Welcome back, LHS. I'm Ariston Scott. And I'm Eli. Today is Monday, April 24th, and we have student information, sports updates, and more. This is your Blue Devil News. Mrs. Alsop's Digital Art and Design 2 class is offering design services for clubs, sports, and other organizations in need. Email Mrs. Alsop with any requests for flyers, posters, or other graphics. Our spring musical, Mary Poppins, received multiple nominations for this year's Spotlight Awards. We'd like to congratulate the following people on their nominations. Callie Cothran and Ella Collinsworth for All-Star Crew, Carson Till and Grace Augusta for All-Star Cast, Riley Taylor on Outstanding Dramatic Performer, C.J. McClellan on Outstanding Dancer, and Grace Augusta on Outstanding Lead Performer. The musical as a whole also received nominations for Outstanding Music Direction, Outstanding Pit Orchestra, Outstanding Cast Vocals, and Crowd Pleaser Performance for Step in Time. Being nominated for these awards is a big accomplishment, and we wish you all the best of luck. The Lebanon High School FFA Livestock Evaluation Team placed second in district and 10th in the region out of 56 registered teams. The team was made up of Kaylee Nelson, John Hancock, Gavin Lowry, Trinea Shipman, and Kaylee Johnson. Tryouts for the Lebanon Marching Band Color Guard are May 15th through the May 20th. Previous experience is not necessary. The Color Guard competes in the fall with a marching band at local and regional competitions and is also able to go on trips to places like Dollywood and San Antonio. If you want more information, a flyer is located on the advertisement board by the bank. You may also see Mr. Chanel or Mr. Amos for any questions. Three Lebanon High School students signed with the Tennessee College of Applied Technology. Congratulations to... Jonathan Diaz Munoz, Zachary Mowdy, and Owen Smith. Cheer tryouts will be held May 3rd through the 5th. If you're interested, please see Miss Mosley in room B204 or to pick up a tryout packet. We'll be right back after these quick segments. Hi, uh, we're back here with another weather segment. As you can see, you know what I mean? The weather looks pretty nice out there, but um, you know what I mean? It's Monday, April 24th, and the, um, the high for today is going to be 60, and then the low is going to be 33. And whenever we get out today, it's going to be 60 degrees, so just literally right next to the high. So it's going to be 60 degrees, right? And um, whenever you guys come in tomorrow, right, it's going to be 43 degrees, so just make sure to bring a sweater, anything, you know what I mean? Just bring a sweater. But, um, Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good day. I'm Amari with your sports updates. Baseball hosts Smyrna this evening for a senior night and softball hosts Blackman. The boys' soccer team play against Laverne tomorrow night. Tennis plays in the District 8 AA tournament starting Thursday. The track team will participate in the pole vault jamboree at Ravenwood High School today, and they'll also be at a JV meet on Wednesday. The Braves start a four-game home series against Miami. Spencer Strato will start tonight against Errol Cabrera. On the ice night, we'll see the Rangers, Devils, Lightning Leaves, Jets, and Golden Knights, and Kraken versus Avalanche. We've only got two games tonight, NBA games tonight, with the Heat facing off against the Bucks and the Grizzlies hoping for a draw even with the Lakers. That's all for sports. See you Wednesday. Thanks, guys. That's all the news we have for today. I'm Eli. And I'm Ariston Scott. And this has been the news to you from, from the, the White and Blue. blue.